I've never seen anything like it. One of the first people to arrive at a head-on crash in Canterbury that killed three people and injured five has described the gut-wrenching scene at the accident site. The smash happened shortly before 11 o'clock today on Bramer Road near Tekapal. Hamish McKenzie from Bramer Station arrived at the scene shortly afterwards and describes what he saw. number of um, emergency crew with um, uh, fire brigade ambulances um, and a logging truck, truck, which I don't believe was involved in the crash. Um, a rental car, which is a you know a small van sort of a thing, um, which I believe to be tourists, and a double cab uh, truck of some sort, which belongs to the logging crew. Um, which are working up the, at Mount Cook Station. Um, so, yeah, it was the tourists and the, one of the logging trucks that was uh, logging crew trucks, not a logging truck, that was involved in the crash. Hamish McKenzie told our producer Bridget Burke the weather was fine, although the road itself can be challenging. Brain uh, Road's a, a windy gravel road, which is, um, it has its challenges, and it's where the crash was, was right on the brow of a hill, and it, Coming from either side of it, you can't see anyone coming the other way, so a central sort of part of the road where you've just got to keep left and take care, but it's uh, you know an unfortunate thing that's happened. It's pretty gut-wrenching seeing that sort of thing. You know, you, you know it can happen and it's, um, you're always aware of it, but, uh, yeah, unfortunately, probably some of the tourists we're getting more of nowadays are um, they're not that capable of... Um, well, they're not that aware of the, the dangers on those sorts of roads, which is unfortunate. Our reporter, Logan Church, is at the scene of the crash. Hi, Lisa. Yes, we're about 20 minutes south of Tekapo on Bramer Road um, at the site of an absolutely terrible crash. This was called in at 10.55 this morning uh, with reports of a two-vehicle collision and the results of that, well, we're standing right in front of. We've got a people mover here and what looks to be a ute, an absolutely terrible condition. The people mover is absolutely smashed up. The bonnet is almost completely gone. The uh, the, the front windscreen is shattered. We can see um, actually, uh, we can see airbags out and actually on the far airbag you can actually see blood. Uh, certainly not a pretty sight. And we can see valuables as well left inside. And just to give you an idea as to who was actually involved with this crash in this people mover here, five people. Three have sadly passed away as a result of this crash to others in hospital. The use over there, we understand there to be two passengers also in hospital. An absolutely terrible situation just south of Tekapo. But just to give you an idea of the size of the crash, we're on Bramer Road, which is an unsealed road. It's very gravelly, it's very slacy, it's slippery. Just driving here before, we had to be extremely careful. Uh, there are a lot of blind corners and a lot of hills which you can't actually see over. Now, the the serious crash unit is here investigating exactly what happened. It's too early to say what's happened, of course, um, and the police cannot say if tourists involved, uh, if tourists were involved or not. But as you can see here, Lisa, an absolutely terrible situation for the obviously the people involved, but also the entire community who feel uh, crashes like these incredibly keenly. And that's Logan Church there reporting from the scene of that crash.